Hello everybody, Moshe, the Electric Israeli here, and today I'm going to talk about a few uh, features and things that came out uh, about the Model 3, the uh, spy shots, uh, supercharger shots, projected range and all that. So um, before I say, uh, before I start, I just want to say I just got into my Nissan Leaf and the temperature is 71 degrees. Beautiful weather, and it's gonna get hot today. I'm gonna get to the <laughs> almost 90s, and um, and then, then I found a nice 106 miles projected range. I like that, cool. And so, um, anyhow, so let's talk about the Tesla Model 3 coming up soon. I hope. Uh, can wait to can wait to get mine. So we'll talk about three things. First thing I want to talk about is the. Uh, the uh, dashboard, uh, it looks like, from all I see, it looks like a square, a 15-inch square. It's smaller than, uh, than the Model S. The Model S is 17-inch, uh, nice rectangle. Um, so, obviously, it's going to be uh, on the side. You look at the pictures, and the, it's going to look like it's split to two sides. One-third is going to be uh, the... Um, uh, you know the car and the speeds and all that and the other side is going to be maybe navigation the other two-thirds navigation and other information it's a little different it's a little different uh, but I'm sure you can get used to it it also sticks up a little bit I'm not sure I like it so um, but that's what it looks like it's going to be second thing is the charge port and charge port looks like some kind of flimsy stuff look at the picture I just put it like it looks like a door I hope it's I don't know maybe it is the final the final design but that's looks like that looks like something is gonna break very quickly what depends if they if that little hinge if it's made out of plastic then I don't know how long it's gonna hold hopefully it makes some kind of a stronger material metal or some stronger material so this looks like something that may not may, may not uh, hold that long we'll see we shall see. Uh, Tesla is known for uh, stuff that break that break so that break all the time. Uh, the last thing, which is the most important thing to me, obviously, is the range. So look at this uh, shot. I'm just putting it on. This shot shows that it could be, if this is a 70 or 75 miles, uh, 75. I'm sorry, kilowatt hour battery. That looks like 275 to 300 miles potential. And if that is the case, that would be fabulous. So I, in my opinion, I assume it would be a 60 mile and a 75, let's say, 60, I'm sorry, 60 kilowatt and 75 kilowatt, which will give you about 220-ish to almost 300 uh, uh, rated range. And that is amazing. That will be really great. Remember, the uh, longest range Tesla today is the P, not no, not the P, the uh, 100D, the Tesla 100D, not the P 100D, the the just 100D. And that takes you to 335 rated range, rated miles. Okay, and always say rated because it depends on the driving. Can have more, can have less, depending on weather all kinds of factors so um, that looks very exciting I hope I hope it's gonna be the top range gonna be 75 I when I get my model at 3 I'm gonna get the top the top uh, uh, battery the other features I don't really care about I, I don't that, that I don't care about that I care about range that's the number one that I, I'll spend all my money on range than on any other any other option I really could care less about the other options. Whatever comes with it, I'll take, but obviously, but uh, if I have to spend my money, I will spend my money on range. So, ho hopefully you excited about this new information, I am. And uh, let's, again, share some opinions about what you think about the um, all the screenshots I put and all the little features, uh, the charge port and the glass roof and the uh, and the uh, dashboard and the projected range and battery and all that. What would what would you spend your money on? How about that? 
Or if you had a limited budget and you say, this is what I'm going to spend money on uh, in specking the um, Model 3, what, what would you, where would you put your money? That's a big question. All right. Okay, everybody. So have a great weekend and please subscribe to my two channels and I will see you again tomorrow in another episode of The Electric Israel.